And welcome back, everyone. Welcome back to more Let's Play Crash Bandicoot Warped. I am the Black Shadow, and it is time for another attempt at Future Frenzy speedrunning. Yeah. I've turned down the audio just a touch, um, so hopefully things sound a little bit better. Got to bear in mind, Future Frenzy is one of the much noisier levels of the game. Well, there you go. That should give you a pretty good test of the sound. Why does this game hate me? I thought we could get on pretty well, be like friends and shit, but no! Oh, Shadow, stop killing yourself, okay? Stop trying to pinch inches, which are clearly not there. It's, it's not good. Because I can. Come on. There you go. Like it. Oh, I wanted to really run. Wasn't gonna happen. Right, we know it's up in there. Oh. Come on. Come on, Shadow. You've done the most of the stage. You know what it looks like now. You know what to prepare yourself for. Oh. So as we notice, it's faster. Do that. Saves about a second. If you're lucky, you might even get the invincibility at the end of the stage. Wouldn't that be cool? About that invincibility. Well, never mind, we got it to work. That's the important thing, right? Ooh! Out of my way! Freak of nature! That's better! Come on, Shadow, that's it! Nothing foolish now! Don't throw it away like some idiots! Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. I tried to throw it away. I desperately tried, but we did it. Huzzah for that. You see? Bit of practice. It's amazing, I know. Incredible stuff. In your face, engine! Like your rocket! <laughs> I win. Alright, Ed, so that leaves just one more relic for us to get from uh, this level Tomb Raider. Now, this could be interesting to do because, of course, you'll remember that this level introduces the. Um, pretty sure it's this one. This is the one that introduces the. Um, the water physics in this game. So, if our timing is bad, then we could lose a lot of time in this. Out my face. Like that. That's nice and generous. We want lots and lots of that. Ah, uh, not that. Go. Sit, wait. There you go. There's a way to shave half a second off. It's off. Oh no! I was going to go for it there. why the game's given quite a, uh, a generous timing! Oh, goodness me, I got away with that one as well! Really pushing some of the... Uh, really pushing my uh, my time in this. Sometimes you got to do it, folks. You've got you to push the boundaries in order to 
hope to, to get the glorious victory that you know should be yours. I'm not running that. Oh no. No! No! Yes! What a, what a save! What a save! No! Oh no! Whoa! You're joking me as that happened. That's a catastrophe. I got. I, I, I fluked it and got on the platform, and then that happened. I feel sick. I feel like I've been alienated. How brave do I feel? Yeah, look at that. Look at me cutting time. Gonna run. Yeah, that's more like it. Real MLG stuff this. I don't know what I'm doing here. I should be getting paid for this. Something. Get out of my face. always do that as well. You can um, obviously hit these with the uh, with your bazooka. You must remember I can do that. Just to make my life a little bit easier there. There's a fault. Can't hit that with uh, that there. That's okay. Oh, I should have ran. I went and wasted the time I made up for earlier. Get up there, man! Ooh, hello. Wage war on everything, and I nearly drowned myself. That was close. Oh, shit. See that happening? I would have no idea. I'm curious if anyone knows, actually. Does invincibility save you from drowning? Uh, I'm guessing it doesn't. I'm curious to know if anyone knows that. Ooh, hurry! I think we're okay. We're okay. The gold run certainly got a little bit caught up in a couple of those uh, filling areas, but that's just that's just a problem. Unfortunately, you, you need some luck for those. They're, they're random, really. They they run on a schedule, but you've just kind of got to guess when you want to go and just hope that you you got good timing on that. Pretty much. Nothing you can do about that. Well, that's cool, because that means we've got 20 relics. You know what 20 relics means? Ooh, yes. Back to the secret warp room. Bye. Doop -doop -doop -doop. That means that our fourth area open, which is our, our, our fourth area open. <laughs> yeah. Which means we can now access the secret area to Future Frenzy. So let's go and do that. Welcome to Future Frenzy's Difference. Oh yes, as I said, I'm batting myself largely using notes. So as you can see here in the hidden route here, just like um, beforehand, you'll notice how there are um, boxes on this stage. So yeah. That's a thing. Cool. So we will have to complete this in extension to get out of the way. In extension to uh, the first area, you see. 
You can also see why there's so much bloody box we get from the nitro. Weird spots the nitros. Uh, uh, uh. Ooh, I think I just tried to jump off the edge of the stage. That would have been bad. Like this is bad. Yeah, that would do. our gem for the, uh, well, for taking the, uh, the special route. Now this is going to put us here. Okay then. How are we going to get the boxes in the first area though? intelligent than I am at the moment. I'm failing miserably. I'm just wondering, would the game, like, kind of say, alright, you've done the death path, that's okay. So when you come through here next, like, normally, we'll, we'll count those um, boxes from that path, because there's no way of getting back to um, to the first area. I don't think. I mean, I assume we wouldn't be able to get back on the normal platform. I don't know how that works, folks, to be honest. Ah, whatever. Anyway, let's get to the uh, end of the stage here. As we will need to do that in order to claim the gem as our own. Don't know why I'm still trying to speed run this, because I'm never going to get myself killed. Like that. Those ever heard of self-fulfilling prophecies? Yeah, about self-fulfilling prophecies. That was one of them. Nope, I will get my box. How did I not get myself killed there? I did everything in my power to get myself killed there. Hmm, let's just have a quick look. <clears throat> See if this game is in as intelligent as I think it could be. So if we were to head back in here now, would the game already give us the boxes it's given us from the first run, from the, the side run? No. Well then, I only, I guess that you can, uh, I guess there's a way you can get back to the then. Maybe you can go on the platform you came here on and it takes you, you can take it back, I guess. And you just got to run for everything backwards. Eh, maybe. I don't know. But I'm not doing that right now. Oh, boy. No, that's not too bad. Lovely. Right, so what else have we got in this place? Then? Just need to double check. For my notes. Ooh, hello. Right, so we haven't got all the boxes in that one. We haven't got all the boxes in this one. All that one. Okay, then. Just so I know. What I'm more interested in doing is getting all these damn relics out of the way. I'd rather do this first. Oh, from one future level to another. Is he here? Is he rustling my notes? 
<laughs> I outsmarted you. Dumb shit. Oh, right, you guys. Out of base. Throw over there, shot. I beat you. Um, time related. No, I'm guessing probably not. Fair enough. Right then, so we got two minutes to beat, folks. As we zoom our way through the Cortex's metropolis. Oh, hello! Ha-ha! Invincibility! You may all die now. I'll give it that at least the music for the invincibility ended at exactly the perfect time. I'll give it that. Why did I agree to do this again? Am I mad? There goes my invincibility. There goes everything else on this. I want my invincibility, damn it. I think that's actually only the second... I think that's only the second stage on a time trial where I've actually had invincibility. I could be wrong on that, that fact, but it sounds reasonably great. Of course, we know we don't need to worry about any of uh, these boxes here. You know, I, I, I was doing, I was running there this bit, and I just thought, I just saw that box, and I'm thinking, well, do I get it? Do I not? I, I really shouldn't have bothered. That's a tricky box to get hold of. Man. Doing pretty well on time, to be fair. Maybe it's just by desire just to always do a little bit better. Which is why I'm going to try again and get it. Because I hate myself. Well, I landed on it. Well, that's worth. Does the game not like... Um it doesn't seem to like me going on some of these boxes when I've got invincibility. It's like, I'm doing that the expectation to bounce off. I can assure you folks, bouncing ow, off is not what happens. So maybe, maybe this is a blessing for the skies taking that in. Maybe it's a blessing for the skies, we shall see. And I'm away. Get on there. Hmm, interesting one that. Uh, I'd say because I've I've fairly been invincible in this game, so I'm not particularly familiar with the um, physics of it as much as anything else of what it's like to be invincible. So I can't see how this is going to benefit me time-wise now. Maybe if I'll tell you what folks, I've got the idea. Let's try and get there. We've been invisible and we'll just ignore that damn box. Hurry up, crash. 
ain't got time to beat this around. I'm trying, I really am. I wanna go home. I, wanna... oh, I need someone's arms to cry in. The game hates me. of that platform there before it activates. That is, uh, that is news to me. And I, only, I gotta remember folks as well, is that I'm only trying to beat the time box two minutes in a second. That's it, Shadow. Good job. Now, don't fuck this up because you've got a second invincibility now, mate. Out of my way. Yeah, look at that. A minute, nine seconds. I don't know what the platinum time for this stage is, but I can't think a minute nine is that far away. I cannot think a minute nine is that far away from that. I think that's that's a good run. <laughs> 